Hello and welcome to Car Pros. Today's video is fuel pump pressure regulator test. First locate your fuel pressure regulator, then remove the vacuum line to check for presence of fuel. If fuel is present, then the regulator needs to be replaced. If you can't find your fuel pressure regulator, don't panic. Some don't have an accessible fuel pressure regulator. Next, we're going to locate the fuel pressure test port and remove the dust cap. Next, here's a shot of our fuel pressure test kit. These are common and are available at almost any parts dealer. Next, we're going to attach the fuel pressure test gauge to the test port. Next, turn the ignition to the on position and the gauge to jump up between 50 and 60 psi. If the gauge rises slowly, this could mean the fuel pump is weak or failing. Next, start the engine. Then remove the vacuum line from the pressure regulator. The pressure should jump between 5 and 7 psi. This means the regulator is functioning properly. Next, load the engine. It should only go down by about 1 psi. If any more, you have a weak fuel pump or a clogged fuel filter, like we have on this car. Next, disconnect the gauge and replace the dust cap. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please feel free to visit our website, twocarpros.com.